guys, it's your girl Sydney and welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to be reviewing Yitty and I think a lot of people know this is Lizzo's shapewear brand. Just for the record, uh, before we get into this video, I am plus size. I average a 3X and uh, size 22 in jeans. I'm 297 pounds, 5'9", you know, so like I'm taller, bigger, I'm a 42G and now I'm going to review this for you guys and I got like a decent amount of things and I didn't realize Yitty is like basically a company with fat so if you have a Fabletics membership, then you have a Giddy one. Yeah, I technically signed up for the membership, but after this, I'm going to cancel it because I'm going to tell you guys what I think. So we're going to start with the Unstoppable Yellow. It's a 3X, 4X, by the way, of the like bralette or whatever. Whatever this is, I will have it linked down below. If you recognize this, though, it's like the seamless Unstoppable Yellow bralette. I was not a fan. I'm going to be so blunt and honest here. Um, I felt like my boobs could, like I have real boobs, you guys. I have natural boobs and the biggest problem with that is like you need them to fit properly and they're squishy like they're not rock hard little rocks you know and I just felt like they couldn't get comfortable in this the straps were way too tight on my shoulders like this isn't shapewear when it's cutting into your shoulder and making an extra groove where it shouldn't be um and I just feel like this was pretty poorly made there's like a ton of little loose strings all over this one it just eh, not my thing at all and my boot this is a three four x you guys and this just didn't look good my boobs like the cleavage looked great but like the actual formity of it didn't look good like one boob looked higher and lower and I had to adjust them over and over the shoulder straps hurt so this one is a hard no for me i'm wondering if the name is on it but it was like the bralette or whatever so not my my thing also when i tried these two things on which i'm going to show you the next one in a second i was like why did i get yellow I don't, I don't know what i thought i was thinking maybe it was like a brown panty i went wrong when i was getting this color i don't suggest it the one thing i will say is that it is nice that it has like that um material that's like sticky at the bottom so it does stay it's just not doing it for me then the bottoms i believe are the same as the taupe so i got these in yellow and in taupe i loved the taupe ones would i ever actually wear them Probably not, but I loved them and I got them in 3-4x and it has the sticky part here and nowhere else, right? I like this. I thought it wasn't bad. This one, the color just really threw me off and that's about it. Like, I, I just don't like the color. The top, I didn't like, but the bottoms were fine and in taupe, I loved them. Like, overall loved them. Then I got unstoppable yellow in these thinking i would like them and i also got them in the darker brown shade i don't like the yellow so that kind of like takes this out right so we're just gonna pretend they're the same thing just different color but we're gonna just talk about this pair that i got and i love this pair okay i love how it goes all the way up to like basically like mid like the higher part of my waist where it really goes in you know how that hourglass shape like it pulls all of my tummy in and goes all the way up to there and doesn't touch my like where my bra would be but it's pretty close to that so i get a lot of coverage with these high-waisted shorts and then the shorts go pretty perfectly there's a sticky part at the top so it doesn't roll down which i really actually do appreciate because i've had a lot of shapewear in the past roll down on me i don't think there's any other sticky parts so it actually wasn't as hard to get on as i thought but when i went to bend over because when you're putting on shapewear, you like bend over to kind of like get it to go up your crotch area. I thought I had ripped the crotch and I realized it's crotch open. So that's great because if you're trying to go to the bathroom, it like, by the way, this stretched so much. When I was like bending over, it opened up really easily. So that's nice because if you're trying to go to the bathroom, like you don't have to take this off because I don't think I could ever <laughs> go <laughs> to the bathroom wearing this. I would just be a bitch to take on and off. So I love this. They leave room and like less suck into the butt area so it's like not as like sucked in the fabric's a lot thinner and it's just overall so freaking nice so i like this color a lot i didn't like the yellow but i loved this this if if you have to take anything from this video the one thing that i'm obsessed with is this i probably will be returning the rest of them but this one i'm gonna keep because i think that the design is great I think that it actually covers and I struggle a lot with chafing and I feel like I could wear this as shapewear and then also deal with the chafing problem that I have with these because they are long enough so 
yeah, those are my thoughts on Giddy. I hope that you enjoyed seeing them on me like while I was talking about it. But I wanted to be super blunt and honest because I think like your money needs to be spent in the right ways. And I wasn't really pleased with the yellow. Um, the taupe bottoms, I feel like if someone is looking for that specific thing, it's great. But this design is epic. And the open crotch, epic. But um, yeah, I think Lizzo overall did a great job. It just seems like some like that sports bra was a mess I, everything else feels high quality thick um and there's no strings hanging off of this stuff so yeah i hope that you guys enjoyed i hope you appreciate this video and um i will see you guys in the next one Mwah!